Donna Spring Chick Chow, and we're going to talk today about the Motorola Bluetooth H15 earpiece. Oh yes, this is a product review of this earpiece. If you're wondering, first of all, why this earpiece? What a, well, because I have it. <laughs> but this earpiece in particular, it has Motorola's Crystal Talk, and I have to tell you, this is a little stand for the Motorola Bluetooth. And the Bluetooth earpiece fits just quite like that, which I love because it sets it off of my desk and it doesn't get all messed up with other things. But the other nice part is if you're traveling, this piece that fits in here plugs directly in here and you can plug the power cord directly into the earpiece, which is one of my favorite. Actually, I'm going to tell you about all my favorite things about this earpiece first. Oh, my, oh yeah. Second, it's the fit. When I first looked at this little crystal piece right here, I thought, oh gosh, it's going to break, it's kind of chintzy, I don't know. And then this little piece right here, with the Motorola earpieces, they come with multiple pieces like this to fit in your ear. And this fits really nicely around your head. And one of the reasons I like that is because when I put it over my ear, it holds very, very well. Because I've had other earpieces that don't hold quite as well. For example, I'm going to show you one of these pieces. This one here is an excellent earpiece too, but this one is a jawbone. This piece right here is metal, and I've already broken oh, uh, at least two of these earpiece cords. Yeah, well, I've broken two here. of them also. Awesome. With this earpiece, it sits comfortably in my ear. It doesn't fall off. And I also go running with Monty. Yeah, remember Monty Bubbles and Chair Dog? And the earpiece stays on. So that part I really, really like. Other part, did you see this? Is when this is closed, it is not connected to my cell phone. When it's open, it is. Now that sounds like it's really, really simple, but what happens is a lot of times when you have your Bluetooth earpieces, it goes on, it goes off, you don't know if it's connected, you're trying to sync it, it's being a major pain in the, yeah. You're totally frustrated. Well, this one is easy. You want it off? Do that. Reserve your battery time. You want it on? Flip it open. Ah, I didn't even get to the speaking quality yet. But this one is really pretty cool. Now, the other part is on the side here. See this? There's actually a little LED right there. You can't probably see it because it's kind of bright outside. Is, it is different colors based on how strong your battery is. Ah, in other words, you might have an idea of how much talk time you have. So when it comes to actual talk time, you have, they say, four and a half hours. Now, I don't know if it's quite four and a half hours. And wait, four and a half hours talk time, 192 hours standby time. No, I, I don't, you know, standby, I think it's just... Oh, yeah. 192, hours, not a long time. 192 hours is a long time on standby. And four and a half hours now, I can't say that I've ever talked on the phone for four and a half hours straight. The part is, I have been able to have this earpiece where it's in the car, it's out of the car, it's in the purse, it's out of the purse. And I don't really pay attention to it and I just have it. And quite remarkably, it is usually still working. Okay. And I, don't I, I, I will testify to the fact that. She, we, 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 I was not joking once when I said that they, we needed to buy a gross of earpieces for them. She break something. Well, yeah, I mean, it's, part of it is, is, I will tell you that this is good for the test of me. I know, I mean, <laughs> and it doesn't even have a replacement policy on it, which she generally buys for it. Yeah, that's true, because I do buy replacement policies on all the electronics. But when I say this is the test of me, one has been dropped out of the car, out of my purse, out of, well, you know, because a lot of times you take it off, you put it in your lap, and you get out of the car, and I've got an SUV, so you're up higher, and the only thing I haven't done is run over it with the car. Yeah, I don't think it would take that. Yeah, I don't think it would. In Las take Vegas, they have a thing, a CES called Last Gadget Standing. Yeah. You know, basically, <laughs> you can survive not as great shit as the Last Gadget Standing. <laughs> Actually. Best of all, as far as the Crystal Talk, I will tell you, oh, oh, here's a couple of other things. Crystal Talk is, I can usually hear people pretty well. Like here, we're out in the ocean, so sometimes if I get too close to the water, it 
may not be as great. But the sound quality, the top quality, I've been really very happy about it. And I compared it to the other ones. Oh, and here's one of my favorite features is on some of my other earpieces, you're there and then all of a sudden um, they're not there at all. I know on some of the older earpieces they were there and then the air the sound happens, quality got a little bit worse and then you could it, it happens with the jawbone in my hand. But you disconnect will, all of a sudden. I would just all of a sudden, you know, you know, you could be standing across the road and I lose you. It, there's no reason for it. It disconnects itself. Yeah. So this one, I mean, it looks quite simple. I like that little case, that little thing you stand that you put it on. The great part about this is that it syncs with two telephones, which actually is pretty cool because you can have two telephones and answer. And you don't have to go, oh, which one it is, change the earpiece, and it'll answer to both of them. Which I, which I really do like. And I will tell you that this is probably one of my favorite earpieces of all time. <laughs> oh gosh, this sounds like it's so definitive. Yeah. It is! Because it's good quality. Okay. What yeah. could it have? If she that can't is, break yeah. it, it means it's favorite. <laughs> you got, okay. One of the things that I wish that this had, although I guess you could use it in a place to put your lanyard. Because myself, yeah. when I have a lanyard attached to it, so I can keep track of myself when I just attach it onto me, this one, I suppose you could put a lanyard through yeah, here, that'd be but that'd then be you can't really close it. So, so I guess this, what I would like is something to carry this with. Yeah. Well, you know, that's the only they thing. They probably never thought about it. I don't know. Well, you know, part of it is, is this is so lightweight, I can keep it on my ear all the time. Yeah. So that part is really, really good. Now, as far as price, you're probably wondering how much is this one? Here's the good part is. Price. Actually, it's a pretty fair price because you can get it from $70 to about $135. It basically, it just depends upon where you're buying it. Yeah. And I think in a lot of cases, you can actually get a discount on cell phone purchases. Oh, yeah, you probably can. Yep, because I've seen them on, I've seen them on sale. If you buy the whole package, they give you a better deal. So this is small, it's lightweight. Lightweight, I love it. And the only thing I wish I had, well, was that I could have put a lanyard on it. But there's not a lot of people that put lanyards on your feet, so I'm probably one of the exceptions to that. Sad about this? Not at all. I can't think of anything that. It, oh, it, maybe more colors? Yeah. But this color well, works. It's not a girly color yet. So. Well, actually, this color, because I have black hair, I just put it in, and people don't even notice that I'm talking on a mirror. Lightweight, I can go running in, it's comfortable. I'm still trying to think about what it is. The only thing I can think about is the lanyard. Yeah. Because I've been able to throw it in and out of the car, not throw it in and out of the purse. It comes to the beach, it goes. Oh, it's a pretty good ear. And, and honestly, I'm, she was using it a few minutes ago on a business call at the beach. Yeah, that's true. I went. And the other part is. I have been testing this earpiece for the last two no, months. Actually, so long. no, longer than that. Since the first of January. No, longer than that, three months. My and favorite. she hasn't destroyed it. I mean, she's went through <laughs> other earpieces since then, folks. This is the last. I told you, the last one standing is the Motorola. <laughs> that's a that's something that they can be very proud of, actually, right there. That's the last earpiece standing. Not only is it one of my favorites, actually, it could be the favorite of all time, thus far, yeah. of all my Bluetooth earpieces. It's still standing. And as far as other ones in the category, well, this is my favorite. <laughs> so for now, this is Joyce, not a spring chick chow. This is my